Hey guys, Gold Evil No one here. Today I will be showing you guys how to make a signature, a simple signature with MS Paint. First off, I think this is with pretty much all the Windows 7 desktops. MS Paint is not on your desktop as a shortcut. So you have to go navigate on your search thing to find it. Just simply type in MS Paint and press enter. And here's MS Paint. You can simply just go to the file location. Uh, let's see. We'll open up the file location and it's over here. Just make it a shortcut. And yeah, here it is. I renamed it to Paint. It's better. So yeah, you open up the application. Now you simp you need a pretty uh you need any kind of image that you want to turn into a signature with. For example, I'll just pick my Dialga. And you need to resize it to a pretty decent size that's compatible with signatures. So now you just, these are brushes, so you can just like paint over it. You can put text with the text tool anywhere. You can edit the text size and the font. Gold Evil 911. And yeah, just do whatever you want to it. You can paint over it. You can put the bucket on it. Oh, where's that bucket? Where's that bucket? Alright, there's the bucket. Alright, you can paint any color for the background. And you can, yeah, just whenever you're done with it, whatever your results may be, you may undo the changes if you mess up. You simply save as and name it signature or whatever you want and you save it. Well, I'm not going to save this because this is kind of a fail. Now you just open up your web browser and you go to imageshack.us and it should go to this website. You browse for the image that you saved on your computer. You can resize it, but I recommend you do not resize it because you have already resized it to your a liking with MS Paint because you can already resize it there, so I recommend you do do not resize and upload now. All right, now in this section over here, there should be form code and alt form code. It doesn't really matter, but I recommend you go with the form code. You just copy the form code and you go to any kind of forms that is possible to go to. And yeah, you find some way to access the signature editing part and you just erase the signature and paste the code in. Now if you don't want your signature to contain imagejack.us, you remove that. And I recommend you remove this URL too so when people click on your signature it will not navigate to the website with your signature. So all that should be remaining are the two image brackets and the website. Click on save changes which I am not because I want to keep my signature and your new signature should be set for any kind of forms that is compatible with signature coding BB code or whatever it's called so yeah I've hoped this has helped you and yeah